And at this point, I was trying to like go the other way, got it, and then I was like, okay, I got it. Went down again. <laughs> two hits, dude. That's all it took was two hits, and I went down. I'm like, cool, sick, great. Let me try to get it again. Uh, no, just kidding. So now I don't have Jug. I don't have a uh, self revive. I don't have any armor whatsoever. I'm gonna like vomit at this point because I'm like, dude, how can I like like I was doing so good and it ended like this. So I finally get it and guess what? I go down immediately. <laughs> I'm like, okay, cool, dude. How much more of the scraps do I have? The elite scraps? What is going on, everybody? It is Abaj1654 here, and today I'm bringing you a little bit of a different video. Today, we're going to try to get to round 50 with the M79 or the China Lake or the Noob Tube or... The Thumper. This thing has many names, but it is consistently one of the worst guns you can use for, I don't know, anything? Uh, anything at all. So this was a challenge. I know I put out something a little bit different uh, than I normally do here. I got to be honest right now, uh, Cold War in terms of content right now is a little bit on that drier side. And I love playing zombies, so I want to do a challenge here and just uh, just have some fun. So before we get started with everything, make sure you guys do hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that bell notification so you do know when we go live, when we upload here on the channel. Uh, today, I'm going to demonstrate to you guys, I skipped like all the way to about round 23, and I was doing this last night. I don't want to bore you guys with the super slow rounds. I wanted to get to uh, certain spots where I was like, uh, like... <laughs> Dude, I was clenching my butt cheeks so hard playing this mode. It was insane. So uh, this method is ridiculous. I basically had the ring of fire on. You could do the a uh, Aether Shroud, which is gets people away. But I did the ring of fire because it allowed me to basically go for my ammo stock. And I got to be honest with you, these megatons are the worst thing ever. Like trying to kill them with this gun or this special weapon is horrible. So let's get on into it and I'll show you guys me physically uh, playing it. So let's get on into that. Okay, so what I was trying to do is either do like decoys or sun grenades to help kind of like push them together, make it a little bit easier for me to be able to uh, to kill them. I have a Pack-a-Punch at the moment. I have it Pack-a-Punch twice, which will give you about three rounds there and about 45 in the stock. And with this one, man, you could even be farther away, and it immediately takes, like, 25% of your damage. Like, immediately. I kept going on top of there so I can get a better range of it as well, too. But I liked it. it was still one shot, one kill for the for the dogs. And, and when you're running this method, I would 100% make sure that you kill the dogs first. But uh, I jump onto here so I can get a better shot. And I just unload three rounds. I just do another three. And that was the method I was kind of going with, like, throughout. I was training in the first room here, and there was certain, like, I would jump off of here, I would shoot, and then I'd run uh, there, shoot, and then I would keep running. And then when I got to that green couch, I would turn around sometimes and shoot if I, you know, had them all, you know, together there. But I would always go up here, jump, do that, and it still takes, dude, I, it literally took 50 to 75% of my health. It literally takes 75% of your health shooting this, and you're at a far distance. And I know, like, jumping can help as well, too, but that was a method that was kind of rolling me through. And that's why I wanted to go to, like, 23 so I could show you guys physically um, a faster round and more efficient round as well, too, than me sitting here just shooting four zombies at round two. <laughs> so here we end up making it to 24 uh, and we're almost, uh, we're almost halfway there. And now uh, we fast forward to... Round 30 here. We end up getting dogs. Now I have the uh, Ed Packa punched all the way three times. But dog rounds as well, too. We're all, I almost went down every dog round because they're like they're sprinting at you. So I would go into um, where that plane wing is. That's probably going to be your best bet to not just get immediately down because they're hauling and jumping at you at insane rates and you can't kill them. Like I had to jump and like <laughs> I had to jump backwards off of it just to get away from that man so this entire time i have not used a grenade i have not used obviously any score streak whatsoever i haven't used anything and uh it's been painful i think i've it was it was taking me over an hour there yeah i think not <laughs> yeah i think not as well because it 
It sucked. I almost die right there. And I'm telling you the whole time, my butt cheeks are like this. My butt cheeks are so tight together and I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna die. And then I get a Megaton spawn in in the middle of the round. Which is, I don't know how that's not broken. Like I had one two or three rounds before this. And I thought they spawned every five to like seven rounds. Nope. It, this thing spawned in the middle of round 31. And I'm like six. So I'm like, okay, let me put the ring of fire on and just take him out. It's not doing a thing. And I, and I literally run out of ammo. And I'm like, son of a balls. Like, are you kidding me? So I had to go and spend 5,000. And then I try to run back to it. And it's gone. And now I'm like, dude, I am screwed. Because that ring of fire, like, for some reason, allows you to take out megatons, like, the easiest. That's why I kept it. It didn't kill any zombies. So it still was, like, a legit only using, um, only, like, using the uh, M79. But at the same time, it was still very difficult to use. Like, whenever this guy spawned, it, was, it took me forever to kill them. And I had it, I have it all the way powered up at three. And then I try to run over here and he would always come out right there. So I'm like, all right, cool. He didn't come out. Let me get some flashes so I can try to do something. Look at that, man. I shoot. I point like literally directly in the chest. So I flashed him, right? Flashed him again. Or stunned him, I should say. Sorry. I am unloading. Unloading like bullets into him. And now I do this. And it's not taking him down. Like, like it's it's just not... And then I lose my armor trying to take him down. I'm shooting him legit point blank. And he's not dying. Like, it's not even taking his health away. And now I have to be careful because... Trying to kill him and do explosions is... Look at this, dude. He's just ripping my health away. So now they finally die. Go get more ammo. Or he splits, I should say. And then I almost... I almost get down right there. I was like, I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> like, I almost just get... I almost get down right there. Almost gonna just throw up. So I just start unloading, man. I gotta... It's, I, I gotta do something. Dude, at this moment, I'm just like, all right, just stick to the plan. Just stick to the plan. Keep training them. Keep shooting them at, you know, precise spots. Don't stop running. Because if you stop running, you're going to die. I thought I was going to die right there because I was running up on all of them. And then, of course, I got a dog spawn in. I'm trying to kill it immediately. And, dude, look at this. I, I like, I, right here, I was like, I'm going to die. There's no way. I was like, he's running up on me. I'm going to die. And it takes forever to get your health back. I'm like, all right, I got it. But they're hauling ass towards me. I'm like, I got to get out of here, man. So I went over to the other place because I was like, I was trying to start to use that to like train a little bit more. Okay, so I start just so I can have more range. So I got, I got it back now. And I'm just unloading. But then guess what? I run out of ammo and I'm at 100 health. And I immediately get down because I was like, I got to go back into the ring of fire, right? I'm like, cool. I, I end up losing a perk and I end up losing my down. Turn around. I lost actually two perks. I lost uh, speed cola and dead shot. I was like, all right, rebuild yourself. And I'm like, okay, let me grab another one. Nope. They're spawning right there. So it, it cuts you off. The Megatron splits like they cut you off. So I try to just haul it all the way around and try to run to this bench here to try to get it. And at this point, I was trying to like go the other way, got it. And then I was like, okay, I got it. Went down again. <laughs> two hits, dude. That's all it took was two hits. And I went down. I'm like, cool, sick, great. Let me try to get it again. Uh, no, just kidding. So now I don't have jug. I don't have a uh, self revive. I don't have any armor whatsoever. I'm gonna like vomit at this point. Cause I'm like, dude, how can I, like, I, I was doing so good, and it ended like this. And I'm, I at least get Jug, but that's not going to do much, man. 
I shot it twice and I was above him. One down. And I'm at 32 health and I get it and then I get closed in. <laughs> like that made me so angry at like 2.30 to 3 in the morning. So at least I tried to attempt to get to round 50. I got down at 31. This gun was absolutely ridiculously annoying to use. It sucked. It took your health away every time you shot the gun. Like every time you shot the gun, it took your health away. So uh, I didn't get to round 50. It was an attempt. Uh, but I want to show you guys actually a, a video and a funny video and something uh, where you can see me like kind of just <laughs> be sweating the whole time. And uh, next time I'm going to get more of a live reaction. This was uh, recorded very late. So if you guys did enjoy this video or want to see more of these videos, uh, let me know down in the comments there. Make sure you guys hit that like, subscribe button, and that bell notification. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care.